Hi, so this is another video in my online gambling series and I am doing something unusual here where I am not betting on sports but I'm betting on politics and so you'll notice I'll be placing two bets here. Uh, one is on who's going to be the next president of the United States so it's going to be Hillary Clinton which has the minus 500 and the money line for that uh, for Donald Trump is plus 300 and then there's also an other uh, which is a long shot at plus 3300 so that is the first bet that I'm placing and the next bet that I'm placing is all the way down at the bottom here and I'll go over each and every one of these uh, so the second bet I'm placing is will the second presidential debate garner more viewers than the first so um, you'll notice I am gonna bet on no it'll be under 84 million and the reason why I'm doing that is uh, simply because the the first presidential election, uh, the debate is always going to be the most watched. And so it's very unlikely that the second one is going to have more viewers, um, which is why this is the favorite at a minus 250, uh, meaning I have to bet $250 to win $100. So for that one, I'm betting $100 and I'm going to win $40. And for the Hillary Clinton as president, I will be betting $500 to win $100. And of course, those that's the money line because I am betting the favorite on both of those. Um, and just to give you a feel of uh, what the state of the presidential election is right now, um, uh, approximately a month away, is uh, f this is the website 589, and it predicted the presidential elections for Obama. Uh, back in uh, what was it 2008 uh, years ago so um, 2008 uh, so you'll notice they have Hillary Clinton winning uh, by 81 percent uh, and Donald Trump an 18 percent chance of winning and they go through uh, the likelihood of based on the electoral college votes and so you'll notice they even have a little graph here of uh, you know some of the odds and the odds changes and so lately Trump has gone uh, downhill and uh, when Trump goes downhill um, Clinton has gone up in her odds of winning um, but also in real clear politics where it goes through all, once again the electoral map um, it shows that Hillary Clinton has a s advantage and so uh, this is by the way is October 8th so it is about a, a month away and going back to some of the prop bets here, basically they're prop bets. Um, so, so some of these are pretty funny. If, if you go through some of them, uh, other than who's going to be president in the United States, there's one where what color will Donald Trump's tie be? And you'll notice it's going to be red, you know, uh, you know, plus or minus, uh, you know, yellow and stuff like that. And you'll see the money line. Of course, the, the uh, favorite here is the red tie. And what color will Clinton's jacket be? And so the favorite here is blue. Of course, in the first pr uh, in, in the first debate, she was wearing a red suit. And uh, you know things like how many times will China be said during the debates? And uh, you know nine and a half times under nine and a half is the favorite here. And how many times will Mexico be said during the debates? How many times will Russia be said during the debates? How many times will trillion be said during the debates? How many times will Donald Trump say tremendous? Uh, so uh, the next one is which network will have the most recorded viewers? And who will win the presidential debate drinking game? Will Donald Trump invent another word during the debate? No is the favorite here. and. Uh, the favorite here is the overwhelming favorite. It's minus 600, meaning you have to bet 600 to win 100. Um, will Donald Trump say big league, big league? Will Donald Trump say huge? Will Donald Trump say build the wall or build a wall? And so, uh, and, and the last one that I bet on is will the second presidential debate garner more viewers than the first? So those are the basically prop bets on the presidential election. And I'll be placing $500 on Hillary winning and uh, hopefully win $100 and uh, betting $100 on the debate being under 84 million watched. And so uh, the reason why I'm placing these bets is um, 
I normally look for opportunity in betting. I don't gamble just to gamble, so I will not gamble on games or anything that's short term. So I don't like gambling on things where uh, anything can happen, like a fluky play or someone someone on the team's off their game, or there could be an injury. And um, you know, once that happens, you know, uh, you know, anything could go. Uh, it's basically a coin toss. So. I, I go for things that I believe are, after research, would be sure things and sure bets. And so these two are fairly safe uh, because based on, for the presidential debate, the second debate, uh, historically, by an overwhelming margin of you know 99%, 95%, uh, uh, usually garners a lot less viewers than the first one. Um, this is a little bit unusual because Donald Trump is a little bit of a showman and a sort of reality star, so it's hard to say in the second debate whether he'll get more. But considering that the first debate was an all-time high, it was an all-time record, that it is very unlikely that the second debate would be even greater than that, uh, especially given the historical uh, context of uh, the second debate. So uh, hopefully that's really it. Um, I'll come back later and, uh, you know, hopefully I will be a winner in these two bets and uh, thank you for watching.